High on the rocky cave ceiling above me, hidden in the darkness, there are vast numbers of bats. You can get some idea of how many there must be because of this huge dune behind me. That's formed of their droppings. And if you see little moving glints on the surface, that comes from an army of cockroaches which are chewing their way through the bat droppings to extract the last particles of nutriment. Some people think there are a million bats up here in this cave. It's impossible to see them in the gloom. But special night vision cameras can reveal them. Densely packed crowds hanging from the ceiling. Their tiny eyes are adapted to low light, but they cannot penetrate the blackness. Millions of years ago, however, these bats evolved an extraordinary guidance system known as echolocation, or sonar. A bat produces extremely high-pitched sounds in its throat and then projects them forward. We have slowed the sounds down, but can still only hear them by converting them to lower frequencies. They bounce off the walls as echoes and are detected by the bat's huge ears. These are in constant movement and enable the bat to map its surroundings with remarkable precision. 